Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with another FGO video. Today I'm going to react to uh, the new animation updates that came in for the Knights of the Round Table. And uh, I'm guessing this is because of the Camelot movie, the movie one that came out. Because of that they got an animation update. And uh, yeah, so I'm not sure how many servants got an update. I can I found a video here which says, uh, I think this is it, like Lion King and Knights of the Round Table, New Noble Phantasm. It came out, I think, five days ago. So I'm guessing I'm probably reacting to the correct video. Um, if I'm not, be sure to like uh, tell me in the comment section because I have no idea. I think this is probably the correct one. And it's like a one minute video. So this will be a short video. And let's see what, like, you know, the animations update uh, they got and i'll talk about my impressions after i uh, see the noble phantasms so yeah and also uh, the link to the original video will be given down in the description box if you want to check the video out go like you know you can do so and uh, yeah so let's get started without further ado let's get started with this video all right so here we go um the noble phantasms start okay first we have tristan Oh, okay, I can see a, a little change here. Okay, nothing much changed as far as I can say. Okay, let's see what we, what's with Lancelot. Okay, this is also the same kind. The special effects are more. I can feel that there are a lot more special effects okay here we go i think this like yeah yeah we did not have previous this previously the whole fire thing you know oh we have latoria's update as well okay all right wow this looks good oh <laughs> Wow, this has the most animation like change. That's it, yeah. So uh, obviously, like it's very apparent that uh, Lartorius animation had the most like you know change. Like as we see a little bit of an animation by the end of her Noble Phantasm, which is kind of similar to as uh, I know like. Um, uh, I think Gilgamesh's update where previously Gilgamesh had an animation where he you only used to like you know uh, unleash Enema Elish that was just it but now I know that he has an update which kind of you know shows his face by the end of it you know when he unleashes Enema Elish we see him like you know uh, animated just like we see like Latoria here uh, like you know a close up of her face uh, like similar to that like Gilgamesh also had a kind of like that an animation update so it's kind of similar to that you know and like you know uh, like uh, in a lot of animations I've seen this like you know they kind of like animate a little bit for example um, uh, what's her name um, okay the altar like, you know where we see like her kind of um, you know unleashing the noble phantasm and in the end we kind of get a close up of her you know and like we see her face and her, her kind of unleashing her noble phantasm and uh, yeah it's kind of like that like i like like these type of animation updates are really nice uh, uh like th the major update obviously uh, uh, like it is lancer artorias the other updates i can find a little bit in tristan's like they changed a little bit of tristan's update is when she, he i think um like uh, I'll, I'll i'll say one thing like before i watched this video i kind of searched the old noble phantasms you know like uh, the old noble phantasm of all the round uh, like night uh, knights of the round table and i saw them so that i can compare it now like that's why like my memory is fresh because i i do not have tristan and neither do i have gawain like i only have lancelot because so that's the why i kind of know lancelot's np before this uh and I, I don't have latoria as well so like to get a comparison before checking this video out like before reacting to this video i kind of checked out the old animation like you know of the noble phantasms that's why i can kind of say here is like otherwise i won't be able to uh, tell the difference because it's so subtle for example tristan uh, i think his own noble phantasm had him shoot the bow 
you know uh like he shoots the bow and then like these like you know different types of this blue um special effects come in and then he kind of opens his eyes and shoots the bow again but here that does not happen i think he kind of plays the bow as a harp which kind of uh like you know triggers the special effect of the where is it yeah of the uh, slash and i think in the previous noble phantasm the slash did not come like this you know it's kind of like uh like in this new uh, noble phantasm the slashes are kind of like you know um diagonal like you know, it's coming diagonally whereas i think in the previous noble phantasm the old noble phantasm his those slashes used to come in an arc you know when he used to pull the bow and shoot it it came as an arc like this and it kind of converged in uh like you know uh, in, into the enemy and it used to curve down whereas in this uh, noble phantasm this is the main major difference i can see is the slashes comes diagonal not curved so and then he opens his eyes here i, I think yeah and he shoots the bow, bow. and obviously another thing is the, we can see uh, the updates is like the special effects are more for example the, there are more colors and you know like the special uh, effects that we can see uh, lancelot i cannot like, i saw lancelot's old animation but i cannot say what like you know change this had it's i think it's very subtle like one thing i can probably say here is maybe the uh, when his uh you know his uh weapon his sword starts glowing maybe the special effects in the sword are a bit more than the previous one i don't know because like i i cannot find what actually is the you know change maybe that is it like you know the special effects are more here and I, I felt like the special effects are more because it feels like when he's like charging his noble phantasm the way everything is glowing you know i think those effects are a bit more i'm not sure like if like you know if i'm mistaking about something be sure to like you know let me know in the comments going i think gawain's um uh, noble phantasm uh, can be like you know uh, differentiated from his old noble phantasm because here we see like him kind of flung, flinging his um, sword up into the air and then we see like the sun and like you know the sword comes back a flaming red i think this is like the new thing that uh, the previous old noble phantasm did not have like the flaming uh, sword and then we see the special effect of like flames uh, around him and when he unleashes his noble phantasm it kind of like you know like like the flames come out i think these are like the new um you know uh the difference of the new noble phantasm and the old noble phantasm and uh, yeah and obviously lancer artorias noble phantasm is very easily differentiable because uh, like you know in the end we see uh the close-up animation of artoria and uh, yeah that looks really good i have to say and uh, the rongo miniat you know was when she's charging her rongo miniat up in the air that also looks very cool the special effects and the animation of the rongo miniat you know it kind of like glowing and it kind of like like uh, you know what i'm trying to say the special effects those looks really uh, like look really nice yeah so i'm guessing th these four only got animation update I'm guessing uh, if I missed something, please let me know in the comment section because I think uh, like, I, like this is the only um, video I can find. Yeah, I, I think maybe these these four only got the animation update. So I'm not sure like uh, maybe they are keeping the other round uh, like, you know, Knights of the Round Table animation update for movie two maybe when movie two comes out they're going to introduce uh like you know more animation update to the other servants for example uh Mordred and who else like um um Mordred, uh did Bedivere get an animation update i'm not sure like i'm not talking now about now previously did he did he get an animation update i'm not really sure but you know moderate bedivere if he did not get any update and who else um wait a minute these two are the only one left aren't they like we don't have agravain as a servant 
So just a sec, am I missing someone? No, I think these are the only knights of the round table that have been introduced. Um okay, uh we have like we got Lancelot's update, uh, we got uh, Gawain's update, uh we got Tristan's update. Yeah. Yeah, we, we only have a bit of fear, I think, is left and Mordred is left. These two are the only one. Now I think um there's another uh, servant who still has not come has been introduced in NA. Uh she's in the JP server uh, like you know in the JP server that is uh, like Sir Gareth, isn't it? Yeah. So like we we got introduced to her in NA, but not as a servant. So yeah, and yeah that's it so these these are the only like you know so i'm guessing like obviously like i i really uh, like i think so maybe they're going to introduce uh animation updates to the other like you know the the knights of the round table who are left like moderate but if you're in the next when the next movie comes out or something like that who knows so yeah so yeah guys that's it that's uh, that was my reaction to the uh np update of the knights of the round table so it was nice uh to see like especially arturia's noble phantasm was really nice i have to say and there were small little changes nothing much i can say for the other knights of the round table but it's really like you know nice to see uh how the animations change you know because i remember like this is a funny thing like i had tamamono my for quite a long while and if you guys know like you know like three three years ago almost three years ago tamamo had very simple animation of like she used to throw her talismans you know and like used to like attack the enemy i used tamamo quite a lot and then i kind of like stopped using her and then when i got to know that she got an animation update and her animation updates were so nice like they like she started <laughs> like you know um uh, what do you call it like uh, unleashing fire ice rain all of these things and like when i start and then i started using her again and i felt so what can i say like happy when i saw her like with these new animations and like it, it really like keeps the gameplay fresh and i really like that they do not forget you know forget about the all the old servants and they still are like uh, i'm talking about fgo and they are still kind of adding like you know new uh, like animation updates to the uh, old servants which people have you know used before but now they're kind of getting forgotten so as soon as they add some animation updates people again start using them and like it, it's like you know they get <laughs> like you know um, uh, we get get reminded of them again and it's like it keeps the keeps the gameplay fresh in a way and it's really nice i have to say so yeah anyway thank you guys for watching this was me reacting to the new noble phantasms of the knights of the round table so if you guys enjoyed my reaction be sure to press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed please consider subscribing because i'm trying to push my subscriber account because so that will really help and comment down below your opinions about these new animation updates anything else you want to say uh, i'll definitely check them out so yeah guys thank you guys for watching again i'll see you guys next uh, in the next video of uh, with an uh, like I'm not sure when I'll uh, you know publish another FGO video like I usually do it uh, once a week but because uh, there were so many things that were introduced in FGO in a span of two or three days I started making more videos on it so usually I make one or one or two videos maximum a week related to FGO so yeah I'll probably like uh, in my time zone is Wednesday when I uh, publish my video, FGO usual video. So I'll publish a video, like, you know, upload another FGO video on that day again. So, yeah, and also if you're interested in, uh, like, you know, my other FGO content, uh, the link to my playlist, FGO, like, playlist will be given in the description box. You can click there and you'll find all my other FGO content. So, yeah, guys. So I'll see you guys then with the next video, uh, which I make on FGO. So until then, goodbye and have a nice day.